Sean as usual. Bathing suit. <laughs> I don't have to be your friend to work with. I can work with you, I can travel with you, and still have an amazing time doing one with other.
Texas, so Montezuma, Costa Rica. I smell trees. So the the um, the chef also does the cleaning, or they no. someone else comes in. Okay. The chef is doing her thing. Oh, good. So this is the second floor. Look at this shit. Oops, I'm cursing. Have you look at the beds and how these beds are hanging, hanging. Look at these bugs right here. Look at this. little indoor the showers are outside oh look this is a cool little tree smell like punks smell like who? punks Get some B roll. We are waiting for our boats. We are going over to Tortuga Island today. So we're waiting for our boats to come get us.
So we are here on Tortuga Island, Isla de Tortuga. Everybody's doing their own thing. I think old dude over here might be smoking a spliff. Volleyball is hanging over there. Showing as usual, bathing suit. You know, I'm always wearing a two piece. I don't care how it looks. People in the background. It's someone's birthday party over there, so they over there chilling. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, over there. And I'm just chilling here, waiting for our food to get cooked. Yeah, and everybody's doing their own thing. So this was the end of our day at the island. On our way back, we saw something very unexpected. On our way back, everyone was really quiet, laid back, not really speaking to each other, not sure the vibe just changed, and then boom. A huge school of dolphins just started swimming right next to our boat. It was super unexpected. Even the guy driving the boat, the captain, was like, oh my God, there were so many dolphins. You see them here, but they were actually some right next to the boat. It was amazing. It was amazing to see. And it just woke everyone up. It just lifted everyone's spirit. Everything changed after that. It was amazing. So this is... Um, um, something that was <laughs> You can't even see that it's water hanging. So we were on our way to a restaurant. The directions told us to walk on the beach about 15 minutes. We get to the beach and we're like, wait a minute. The way that this beach was set up, you couldn't walk on this beach to this restaurant. So when you hear me saying I'm confused, I'm like, look, look, you, can, you look, you could not walk on the beach. I'm like, where the hell is this restaurant? Okay, so after that whole not finding the restaurant on the beach debacle, we wound up going to a place that was literally right behind us. We wanted to go to this restaurant on the beach because it was on the beach, but we could not get there. And again, the GPS was not um, efficient. It just tells you, you know, what GPS normally tells you, which is where to go. They don't know what the conditions are. So that was no. We wound up going to this restaurant called, well, this hotel called Naya, N-Y-A. We went to Naya, and they have a restaurant there called Umbutu. Umbu? Ubin. Ubin. That's the name of it. I'm talking about Umbutu like I'm in Africa. Ubin. So we wound up going there. As you can see, it is lush. It is green. It is beautiful. The setting was amazing. It is a open setting restaurant. So everything is open and you can actually see shots of the beach from the restaurant and this hotel. So it wound up being really, really nice for us. Oddly enough, this was the end of our retreat. So we went out for a celebration dinner. But oddly enough, it started pouring pouring one of those costa rica rain central america rain in the evening types of pouring pouring so much so that we wound up getting stuck 
at the restaurant and the hotel. Luckily, they had an open room. We had to book a room and stay the night at this hotel, which is crazy, but it all worked out in the end. When we woke up in the morning, they had breakfast ready for us. They understood what we were going through. And then we jumped in the car and went back to our other accommodation. It was crazy, y'all. This is Hearts of Palm Ceviche, my first time having it. It is now one of my most favorite things to eat. Oh my God, thank you so much Costa Rica for introducing me to this dish. If you have not had it, you need to try it ASAP, like ASAP. A driver to what? Well, no, I told you. That's what I was saying yesterday. It only rains at night and then in the afternoon. It don't rain in the morning. 